You may have seen a lot of this kind of animation on social media or YouTube. It's really amazing and eye-catching. It's called whiteboard animation. Creating this kind of animation is so easy and the most interesting thing is that it's monetizable. If you can create good quality whiteboard animation with narration, then YouTube will monetize your channel. So it can be a great source of passive income. If you are feeling excited, without further ado, let's dive in. Today, I will use Canva to make the whiteboard animation. Canva is a widely used all-in-one designer tool. You can use it for free or can use a 30-day free trial. Canva is now more powerful with several AI features. Recently, Canva launched a vast number of AI tools to make the content creation journey easier. Speedpaint, one of them. And today, I will use this tool to make our whiteboard animation. All right, open a new tab and then search for Canva. After getting the search result, click on the first link. Now, if you are the first time in Canva, click on the sign up button from here. Now you can continue with your email or with your social account with Apple, Google, Facebook or Microsoft account. I will go with a Google account because it's very simple. After creating the account, your dashboard will be like this one. First of all, we have to create a new design. You can create a design from here by your design type or create a custom design by entering pixel value. I will create a new design with 1920 by 1080 pixels. After entering the value, click on create new design and this is the creator page. Now we have to select an idea. For example, I want to make kids learning videos about fruit introduction with the alphabet and fruits. Add a text heading for the text tab. After that, replace the alphabet. Set the position of the alphabet. After that, enter a fruit name that resembles the alphabet. For example, apple. Now we have to enter an image or sketch of the apple. Come to the Elements tab from here and then search for Sketch Apple. You will find a vast number of Apple sketches in the Graphic tab. Just select one of them. You can select black and white and color as you wish. After selecting the element, customize its size and position. Always give time to design to get better results. OK, our first image is ready. Now let's move forward to the second one. Click on the duplicate icon from here to duplicate the design. Scroll down and select the second page. Change the alphabet to B and then enter a word that resembles with letter B and then enter a related sketch. In this way, create new pages and design for all of the alphabet. For tutorial purposes, I will go only with three pages. After completing the design, click on the share button from here and then download all of the images as ping files. OK, our designs are ready. Now we will create the whiteboard animation with these images. To do this, first, click on the File button from here and then select Create New Design and then select Video. After coming to the new page, come to the App tab and then search for Speed Paint without giving any space between the words. Now select the Speed Paint tool from here. First, we have to upload the image. We want to turn it into an animation. Let's upload the first design. After uploading the images, select the FPS. I will keep it to 60. After that, Set the sketch duration time. Let's set it to 10. Then the color fill duration. If your images have color, then select a fill time, otherwise select zero. After that, set the background color. I will keep it white. Next, the hand animation. If you want a hand animation, then turn it on. Otherwise, skip it. Next, if you want to add a wipeout effect, then turn it on. After all is set, hit the animate image button. It will take some time to animate the image. Let's first forward the video. And here it is. You can see that a video clip has been added to the video page. Now click on the three dot menu and then select set as background to full screen the video. Let's see the result. That's good, but a little bit lengthy. Let's regenerate it with some customization. I will reduce the sketch duration and color fill duration. And here is our result. Without color fill, it's looking very bad. Let's regenerate with minimum color fill duration. I think now it's perfect. Always play around with the value to get a better result. All right, our first animation is ready. Let's create animation with the second image. Click on the plus icon from here to create a new page. After that, come to the Speed Paint tab 
and click on Choose File and upload the second image. As we get a better result with the current setting, I won't change any settings. Hit the Animate button and our animation is ready. Set the video as background. In this way, generate animation for all of the images. You can add some extra footage at the start of the video to make the video more captivating. OK, after all is set, hit the Share button from here and then select Download to download the video as an MP4 video file. And our video is ready, let's have a look. That's really a good whiteboard animation video. You can add more elements and a voiceover to make a perfect kids learning whiteboard animation video. If you want to make a detailed tutorial on this, let me know in the comment section. I will make a detailed video. Alright friends, I will wrap up our video now. Before that, I would love to hear about your experience of creating a whiteboard animation with Canva. Share your thoughts and results in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, happy creating!